Damascus, Virginia. Today we're going to be doing the Virginia Creeper Trail. Um, we're here we're with the men's group from our church, but we're at the uh, bike station. Uh, they're all picking up their bikes. We brought ours. We're going to be riding. Um, so we're just going to take the shuttle up to the top of the mountain and then come riding down. So um, come along for the trip and hope you like it. Uh, if you're ever in Damascus, I think this would be a good place to have some nice bikes in here. You can rent, um, and they'll take you up the mountain and bring you back down. So, I mean, you come down and then drop your bike off here. But anyway. <laughs> hey everyone, right. um, we've made it to the top, where we're going to start at anyway. It's um, White Top Station, so the van brings you up here. They're all kind of dropping off over there right now. Um, but anyway, this is where we're going to start at. Um, right now it's a little breezy and kind of chilly up here. So I'm ready to ride and get warmed up a little bit. But apparently a lot of it is downhill, so... Alright, we'll show you the sights along the way. Um, right here there's a big Christmas tree farm. Across the street. Looks like people have already been out tagging their trees. It's got little colored markers on the top of some of, some of them. All right, this is the White Top Station. It's from the old railroad line. Feels like it's about 40 degrees. <laughs> All right, so here at the little train depot, they have a um, history, a little bit of history about the area here, so it's kind of interesting. Um, when you come here, you can check it out. I want to keep two hands on the wheel. <laughs> it's a little bumpy here and there. overlooks you can stop at walk up to got some pumpkins down there in the field and Christmas trees all right here <laughs> there's one right there it's a freezer fur it's a little baby one Imagine like a train going through here. Being the engineer of it. All that weight. 
going downhill. <laughs> we made it down to the pumpkin patch. What? Pumpkin patch? I guess up on the hill up there is where we were. We're at, uh, we stopped at Green Cove, and this is another train station, but it also served as a general store and post office, and whatever else. It's kind of inside here. Who would have thought there were so many places to see along the route? I thought it was just a trail. So we're going backwards. We are back on our way down the trail. And it's a little bumpy. <sighs> As you can see, it's a pretty busy trail. Lots of people on it this weekend.
big bridge on the creeper trail. I guess maybe the biggest of all of them. Appalachian Trail. To Taylor's Valley. I'm following this stream down the mountain. Taylor Place is this cafe, Hellbender's Cafe. It's supposed to be good. I don't know. But anyway. Here's By the way, this is the cafe. You can see it's a very popular place to stop off along the trail. So anyway, we're gonna continue going on down the trail that way.
on through a little community right here. Walk a mile lane. Go figure. There's the Porta Johns. Got some Porta Johns up here for your bathroom convenience. This old rail car. I did notice um, along the way here there are a lot of um, campsites, primitive campsites. Came to another stop off spot here. Anyway, um, I guess people hike, you can hike the creeper trail, but also uh, there is a spot up higher where the Appalachian Trail crosses over the creeper trail. Um, so I guess they allow camping, primitive camping up along the trail here if that's something you're interested in. I think we're getting very close to uh, town now. The highway is right up on the, up here to the right. Kudzu! I think we found Bigfoot. He's on the creeper trail. And we made it back to civilization. goes down under the bridge here and then <clears throat> follows the herd back into Damascus. Welcome to Damascus. All right we made it back to the bike station. Uh, it took us about four hours. Uh, we left it, got up there about 10 and got back down here about 2.30. 
and then we had tracked somebody down, so we went out finding them, looking for them. Uh, but anyway, it took about three and a half, four hours to come down and stopped along the way, as you see in the video. So, um, but it was it was a really nice day, even though it was a little cloudy, and had a good time. So if you're ever in Damascus, Virginia, um, there are lots of bike rental places. I'd recommend this place here, the bike shop. Um, a lot of the other bikes on the trail, some of them people were stopping with chains popping off and flat tires and stuff like that. And everybody in our group came back here okay without any trouble. So I'd give a recommendation for the bike shop if you're in Damascus. All right, so it's uh, thebike-station.com. All right. Catch you later.